Let's look at the qualitative characteristics of cost and management accounting information. How cost and management accounting information is supposed to look like. The first characteristic is verifiability. Like it should be verifiable. Someone can be able to verify it or prove it. So it refers to the ability of accountants to ensure that accounting information is what it purports to be, like it is what it is. It also means that the selected method of measurement has been used without error or bias. An example of verifiability is that if two accountants are looking at the same information like inventory evaluation, can be able to come to similar conclusions. So the information is true without error or bias. So verifiability, it means that the accounting information is what it purports to be, or it is what it is. The second characteristic is objectivity. Objectivity comes in when you use a reliable source to make decisions or to come up with results instead of you guessing or basing on emotions or being subjective. So objectivity in this case is where an accountant relies on verifiable evidence such as delivery notes, invoices, orders, physical counts in the measurement of financial results Instead of them just guessing that I think the inventory was this and this, no, they use information from the physical counts. Instead of just guessing that I think the other order was like this and that, no, they use a real order and delivery notes and all that. So that is objectivity. And objectivity makes it possible to compare financial statements of different firms with an assurance of reliability and then uniformity. So that is all about objectivity. You come up with something, but when you're basing on reliable evidence, not just basing on emotions or guessing. Another characteristic is comparability. Your management accountant should prepare the accounting information in a consistent way for every year. It is much easier for a company to make comparison with the past accounting information or related entities. So there should be consistency in the preparation of accounting information so that comparison is easy. So another characteristic is reliability. Reliability is something you can depend on or something that performs the way it is expected to perform. So accounting, cost and accounting information should be reliable. So the reliability of an item is the probability that the item will perform a specified function under specified operational and environmental conditions at and throughout a specified time. And the best way to specify the reliability of an item depends on how the item is expected to perform and how it is performing. Another characteristic is understandability. So cost and management information should be easily understood by the users. So a management accountant should be able to prepare the accounting information and summarize the report so that it can be easily understood by the decision makers. The last characteristic is relevancy. So the cost and management information should be relevant to the users or to the decision makers. So you should not talk about things that are not useful to them, maybe which employees were fighting amongst themselves. Such information is not important to them. So you should give them information that is important, how much you're incurring in different activities, how much profits you're making, stuff like that. So you should provide information that is useful to the decision maker. So those are the characteristics of cost and management information, accounting information.